Hi guys, good morning. I'm in my nursery right now and I'm just getting ready. We're gonna go out for the day. We're gonna go to the chiropractor. So that's just about like a half an hour from where we live. Um, but I'm just gonna take you through what we do to get ready to go out of the house with the three month old. Um, she's in the other room right now just playing and I just got ready. I was able to get ready while she played. But other than that, I'm about to eat breakfast and feed her and then I'll show you what we have to pack up to get her ready to leave. Hey, Missy. She's already getting fussy. I haven't got to make breakfast, but she's just in her little swing with all of her toys. Sorry about the lighting out here. It's really dark today. Say hi. <laughs> this is smile. Okay, so I'm going to hurry up and try to make breakfast while she plays, hopefully, but she's starting to get hungry. So we'll see how well this lasts. See Bryn right up here. While I'm eating, don't mind my messy living room. Um, but I'm just gonna eat my breakfast and then we'll start getting her ready and we're gonna head out to the chiropractor. This is what breakfast ended up looking like. Someone wanted to come out and join me. Hi, Brittany. Hi. So, we're finished up. This little cutie. She just wants mama this morning now. Huh, do you just want mama? little chunkers your little chunky legs we gotta go get you ready oh, now I'm going to get Bryn ready so let's get ready and right before this she spit up all over herself so we gotta get her <laughs> is that funny is that funny yeah so we just gotta wash her face hi she didn't need a bath today because she um, just had one yesterday and we do every other day with baths because her skin gets a little bit dry. <coughs> but... We're just gonna read a book since we're not in a big rush and yeah we'll just read a book
feeling better. You just wanted to sit up. You didn't want to lay down, huh? She's been sitting up so well lately on my lap. Can you say hi? I think you need a bow on. Let's go get your bow. Hey, look. Do you want to see the toy? She does not like cats, but this is too cute on her. Hey, boo, boo, boo. She's very tired. We need to go down for a nap, huh? Can you hold your toy? Okay, hold your toy. Good job. Oh, straight into the mouth. We have to get going, Bryn. Bryn just got down for her nap, so I'm going to show you everything that I packed so we can leave once she gets up. And we won't be gone for long, so some of this stuff might be a little excessive, but it's just what I normally bring. So I have a little passy pouch right here. And in here I keep my shield for nursing and her passy, and then also I bring an extra one, an extra passy, but she has that one um, in her crib right now. And then I have her bright water here, and I just keep that in the side pocket for if she gets the hiccups. In the front pouch, before we leave, I will pack some frozen milk packets, probably just one because we won't be gone for that long just in case she needs to eat while we're gone and she won't nurse because she's been having trouble nursing lately. So I also have a bottle to warm that up in and then I'll bring a thermos of hot water um, just in case she needs to eat while we're out. I'll bring that. But I am taking her to the doctor's. Um, next week is her appointment with a specialist to see if she might have a tongue tie or any issues like that. Um, but yes, so that's why I have the bottle. And I have three burp cloths because she spits up a lot. And I also have um, a bib in here. In one of the little pockets I have a bib, a little toy for her. And I have her passy wipes in case she drops her passy. Um, I have her papers filled out that I have to bring to the doctors with me. Of course, all her bows in a bag because you can't leave the house without bows. I have a comb and a brush in the side pocket here. And I have plenty of outfits. Well, I have two outfits, a little shirt and some leggings. And then I have a pair of pajamas and a onesie. I should probably grab another onesie before we leave. And I have some extra socks in here. Those put back in. And then I have her diaper pouch, which I love this. It's the Jujube, it matches her diaper bag. And then I always pack five diapers. I don't know why I don't need that many if I'm not going anywhere for long, but I just always grab five. I have her wipes and her uh, diaper cream. I couldn't think of what it was called for a second. Um, that I keep in here. And then of course the diaper pad that goes in the back of the diaper bag. And that's about it. Oh, and I have her toy. It's called a Winkle, and this is her favorite little rattle toy. So I always bring that to entertain her. And that's about it. I always just feed her before we leave the house. And that way, I don't have to worry about a bottle when we're out if we're not gone for too long, but I have it just in case we're gone for a little bit longer than we have planned. And once she wakes up, I'll feed her and then we'll leave. So. That's about all that we do to get ready to leave the house. Thanks for watching. Um, I hope you enjoyed the video. Leave below in the comments what kind of videos you'd like me to make um, because I'm just new and starting out. So I'd love to hear your input and let me know how I can improve my video. I'm trying to decorate my office and set that up so that way I can film like this part of the video in there and maybe do some sit down videos. But right now I'm just um, testing this out with my phone let me know what I could do to improve and also what kind of content you'd like to see.